Hey guys, I'm Matt, this is Jen, and we're the co-founders of Canvas Me. We are so excited that we just recently partnered with the Global Artistry Council. We know you just recently attended an event, and we know that you may have heard our name, Canvas Me, to go onto our site to create a portfolio and apply for some really awesome opportunities. There's two opportunities. The first one is an opportunity to share the stage at the next Global Artistry Council, which is really awesome, yep. sponsored by Aura Software. The second opportunity is for a scholarship through Milady. And so you can apply to both of those opportunities on Canvas Me with a click of a button mm -hmm. by creating a free Canvas Me portfolio. So you can come to our site. So we're gonna show you how to do that. It's really, really easy. It doesn't take a ton of time. You can upload images, you can upload video. You can make sure to follow the requirements for each of the opportunities. So we're gonna show you how to create a free portfolio on Canvas Me. And then we're gonna show you in a second how you're gonna to navigate to those opportunities and click a button to apply. Really, really easy. And even if you don't win those opportunities, you still win because you can still leverage your Canvas Me portfolio and use it like a website. You can copy your link, you can paste it for any other opportunity in the beauty space. You can almost use it like your online portfolio slash website slash resume, right? You can use it to really land some really awesome opportunities and to network with people. It becomes your own place where you can highlight everything about yourself. So even if you don't win, you win. We're gonna dive in and show you uh, how, to, how to get that done. So here we are on canvasme.com. And before I show you how to create your free Canvas Me portfolio, I just wanna share what a Canvas portfolio looks like so that as you're creating this, you know exactly what, we're cre what you're creating. So this is a community of all beauty professionals and their Canvas Me portfolios. So this is Erin. I'm gonna click into Erin's portfolio. And I'm just gonna show you, this is what you'll be creating today as you create your Canvas Me portfolio. So this is what it looks like. You can upload images, you can upload video, um, you can talk your education background, you can upload my work images, um, ton of key performance metrics, right? So really, really powerful on how you show up. Once you create your portfolio today, you could take this link and share it with the world. But also more importantly is what you're gonna do when you create this portfolio is you're gonna browse opportunities. Once you browse opportunities, you can use this keyword search and you can type in GAC. This is how you're gonna locate the scholarship opportunity. So you type in GAC, it'll pull the scholarship opportunity up, right? Once you've created your portfolio, you can click into this. You can read a little bit more about what the scholarship opportunity entails also, make sure you pay attention to this how to apply section, right? So you're going to take this how to apply section. You're going to make sure you meet all of that criteria. You're going to come back and you're going to click send my canvas. You can customize this message here if you like, um, but you don't have to. And then you're going to hit send my canvas one more time. Uh, the GAC uh, council will get your Canvas Me portfolio and then they can uh, decide on the, the winners, right? So really, really easy. Once you've created your Canvas portfolio, it's a click of a button that you're applying. For and, the and again, guys, just make sure that you are, they are looking for some video requirements. They want you to answer some questions and then upload video, which you can really easily do to your portfolio, which we'll show you how to do. But again, make sure you're looking at those requirements. The second opportunity that you can look for is share the stage. So if you just type in share in the keyword search, go back to the opportunities, type in share. You're gonna see this share the stage spotlight opportunity. So you can click in here again, it's, it looks similar, but it's a different opportunity. Again, making sure that you see the how to apply. There are some questions that they want you to answer. Um, and so just check out what these are, what these items are. Make sure that you're meeting that criteria. Come back to the top and hit send my canvas. You can also answer some of those questions in this uh, text field here as well. And then hit send my canvas, right? Uh, so really, really powerful in how you can show up. So how do you get started with a beautiful Canvas Me portfolio? I'm going to show you right now. So you're gonna to come to canvasme.com. You're gonna get click this get started button in the upper right. Once you click that button, you sign up with an email. So you're gonna enter in your email and you're gonna enter in a password. Make sure that you meet these password credentials. It's highlighted here in orange. It's an uppercase, a lowercase, a char special character and a number. Once you meet that criteria, the sign up button will light up. It does not light up if you don't have at least one number, at least one special character. Um, and then an uppercase and a little lowercase. So just keep that in mind. You're gonna click sign up. Once you click sign up, you're just gonna identify who you are, industry professional with a license. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna take you through that. 
And then at this point, you're just gonna select the category that you have your license in, right? So I'm gonna select Cosmo. You can input your license number in right here, but you don't have to right now. You can do that later. I can click next. At this point, you can just select whether you're employed or unemployed. And then when you're here, in order to uh, uh, create that free Canvas portfolio, make sure you're selecting a personal Canvas. So some of you that may have already created an account might have selected a business Canvas. This comes as a charge. Um, so we don't, you don't need to create a business canvas. You're just creating a personal canvas so that you can apply for these awesome opportunities um, as a beauty professional. And for those of you guys who actually did already select a business canvas portfolio, when you go back to edit your canvas, you have the option to add a personal canvas at no charge. So I will, I will walk them through that. So you're going to select per, a personal canvas. And now you're just going to enter in your first and your last name. Um, and then your job title, you can just select from one of these categories, right? Um, whatever makes the most sense. If none of these apply to you, you can just make sure that you use the other, right? You don't have to uh, use any of these canned uh, options. And then you're going to put in your mobile number. And the reason for your mobile number, we are not going to display your mo mobile number anywhere in your portfolio. It's really just so that we can verify that you are a human creating this portfolio on behalf of yourself. And so we're just gonna send you a text verification code to verify that it is you. Um, once you get that code, you're gonna put that in. So I'm gonna put that in right now. And you're gonna hit confirm. Once you hit confirm, this is the Canvas portfolio creation. Now, some of you may be on a smaller screen. If you're on a tablet, holding it horizontally will give you this view, right? So I'm on a bigger screen. So you're getting this bigger view where this is a preview of your portfolio. And on the left-hand side, this is where we're adding information about ourselves. So we're opening and closing up these uh, folders and we're just gonna add the information as we add it to upload images. You're gonna click this arrow, it'll sync to your camera roll. You can make that selection and you'll watch it import, right? So if you're on a tablet, holding it horizontally will give you this view where you could get a live preview. For those of you that are on a smaller screen, um, you'll just have this view where you'll be able to start at the top, right? You won't get a preview as you're entering in information, but what you can do is you can hit this little eyeball up here at the top, right? So once you start filling in the information, you can hit that little eyeball, you'll get a preview um, of what you're uh, starting to build out, right? So for now, once you're done, you're gonna hit publish, right? That will create your Canvas Me Portfolio link. Um, you'll also, if you come to the top and say my canvas, you'll be able to see this where you can view and edit your portfolio, right? For those of you that have already created a portfolio, but accidentally chose the business path where you had to pay for something, all you have to do is log in using those same username and uh, password credentials, come to the upper right, browse my canvas, and then just hit here, add new canvas, and you'll have an option to just add a professional canvas, mm -hmm. right? Because I already added a professional canvas uh, already, it's not here, but you'll see the option to add a professional canvas and you'll be able to make that selection um, and create a new canvas, which will bring you right back to the canvas, which will bring you right here, right? And you'll be able to start adding and editing so for those specific two opportunities, there is a video requirement. And so how you're going to upload the video is you're going to come into your edit mode. You're going to look at the media assets folder. You're going to open this up, right? And then you're going to come down to the featured video and you're going to hit this little arrow. So this arrow will allow the system to sync with your uh, camera roll, right? So whether you're on your mobile device or if you're on a computer, it'll sync to your files, right? So you're going to create that video. You can create it right from your phone and then you can click this little arrow, it will sync to your camera roll, you can make the selection. If you don't wanna do that, you can also upload it to a YouTube account if you already have a YouTube account and just insert the YouTube link here and it'll, it'll bring in that video right from YouTube. So really flexible, you can do either or. And you guys also below that, Jen, I'll show you right here, you can have the ability to upload additional videos, right? So if you wanted to answer multiple questions with different videos, you can upload more than one video. Yep, this video here, if you click this button, the videos will start to filter into your My Work section. So really, really powerful. And once you're done, you're gonna hit publish, right? Once you hit publish, you'll also have your link, but then you can navigate, like we talked about earlier, you're gonna navigate to the opportunities, you're gonna search them, although they are right at the top, 
Um, so these two opportunities, right? Select which opportunity you're applying for, click the opportunity, make sure again, you're meeting the criteria and you're gonna hit send my canvas. And again, even if you don't get selected for this opportunity, you can still win because you're gonna have a beautiful representation of your portfolio. You're gonna have this beautiful link. It's a custom link. It'll even have your first and last name in it. And you can share it with the world to be seen for some really awesome opportunities. Good luck and we'll see you on Canvas Me. Bye guys.